This episode of Storytellers is brought to you by these fine companies. Were you you were match racing, I believe, Beetle the night that they burned the tower down. You remember that? Uh, it's possible, yeah. <laughs> they did that a lot. I'm Waterbed Fred Miller, and you're watching Storytellers on Competition Plus TV. Well, Bill Doner, who owned all the good racetracks on the West Coast at one time, uh, we did a tour for him, uh, and we were in U Eugene, Oregon, and uh, the place was packed. Uh, we had made a, a couple of runs, and uh, we were out working on the car, myself and Harry Schmidt, and uh, we're parked right next to Jungle. and. I see Raymond come running back. He jumped up in the trailer, came out with his pistol, tucked it in his pants, and ran back up the tower. So I, I knew something was up when I saw his pistol come out. He comes back and says, load all this stuff up and get out of here out the back gate, you know, as fast as you can. So and we told Jungle that too. I go, okay, well I don't know what the deal is. So we loaded it up in a hurry. What had happened? is they had a curfew and uh, when Donor announced that we wouldn't be making the last run, you know, these people paid a lot of money to see uh, Blue Max and, and Jungle, and, uh, and Jungle didn't come out that far very often because he didn't need to, he could make all his money on the East Coast, but so we're loading stuff up and, and going on. Well, little did I know, once we got loaded up, they had, they had caught the tower on fire uh, because they were mad because we didn't make another run. But uh, Donor and Beetle grabbed the money and went one way, and we got in our trucks and trailers and went out the back door. So uh, that's, that's kind of like, that was match racing back in those days. How, how did they escape? They had, uh, Donor had a little a private plane there to take them all out and, and whatever. So I'd take them all, it was a little small plane that they landed on the thing, and, and uh, they jumped in that and, and went, and we drove the rigs out of there, you know. How many people did you almost run over getting out of there? Yeah, yeah. Well, I think the one thing it wasn't, the fans weren't actually mad at us. Uh, it didn't seem like, or they could have, you know, stoned the rigs or something. But they were sure mad at the track management, I can tell you that, you know. Which was Bill Donner. Bill Donner. Bill Donner had a pension. Getting people mad at him, didn't he? Well, he, he had he could do anything he wanted up there. He was uh, he kind of ruled the uh, Northwest with his racetracks and whatever. He put on the greatest shows on earth. Period. <laughs> 